Here than fuck. <laughs> boy, boy, take it. <laughs> Fucking emotions management issues. <laughs> oh, gee, I don't know, James. Shall I rehearse the last couple of hours of play? <laughs> I'm sure we could come up with something. <laughs> emotional management. What emotional management issues? Yeah, let's see. Initiating not one, but two crime scene investigations that you were not supposed to do. And stealing evidence from one of them. Never listening to your boss. Yeah, I really don't know where she would get such ideas. Hey, a James. chicken! <laughs> yeah, you better think fast, James. What are these figurines? <sighs> They're memories. I've read that after an Icarite transplant, especially an illegal one, some can be lost. That one's the most valuable. digging and we dug until we unearthed this statue of liberty figurine it was beaten up but valuable and we fenced it right away and we came back here hoping to find more Either afford children, or you can afford new bodies. Not both. I was ahead of my family by the time I was 15. We found out there used to be a museum here, so we dug more. Day after day, until our hands were bloody. For normal people, tortured of misery, desperation, but. Adventures on a fucking treasure hunt. Mm. We glued, fixed, and sold everything we found. Could you believe we we excavated this whole place like a pair of underage slum archaeologists? Must have taken a while. Almost five years, but it was our livelihood. We were dirt poor, surrounded by dirt. But we felt rich. At least until Taylor tricked me. Eight years ago, it would take a few days. Sister? No. We were 
in love. I remember exactly when she tricked me, because it was when I turned 21. Her subscription. And Taylor paid for it for me. She did it behind my fucking back. That's bad. I'm missing. After a month, her subscription expired. We were broke. There was no one to help me. She wound up in the bank. In the body of the auction. Oh. That's why I have to get She feels out. guilty. No matter what it takes. You get it now? Whoa. Oh, fuck. <laughs> Chucky Libs! Damn it. Got any ambrosia anywhere? Anything higher octane? I'll pour us something. Or you can also help yourself to ambrosia in the bedroom. He'll probably help himself to himself ambrosia in the bedroom. Famous psychologist. Blood tests. From the beginning of the month. Oh, that was when they confiscated Taylor. Forklift. Counter off those every day at work. Hmm. Height chart. I remember it. <laughs> this is older than me. Chicken of Justice. about night lights, huh? open twenty seventy one Green Bank acid rains ravaging our planet will not cause the extinction of the flora. The new project involves collecting bulbs and seeds and temporarily creating holographic facsimiles of all plants. The real most exquisite specimens of flora will still be on display in the roof sections of the living museums. Hmm. Hey, there's another chicken. Ah, oh, this must be the whole gang.
Well, Mr. Justice himself. Trophy! We like trophies. James, aren't you afraid your memories will eventually fade away? Lucky me. I don't fade. They haunt me. Literally, than I'd like. You must have some good ones. At least one. We're at the movies, and Rachel tries to convince me it's a crime flick she's already seen. They were all the same to her. And of course, she's teasing me, and I'm trying to watch the fucking movie right now. I'd give anything to be sitting there next to her. I'd focus all my attention on her. Maybe then you wouldn't remember it. Maybe it's the imperfect moments that create the most precious memories. I found a hen of a damned intricate make. You solved the puzzles? Congratulations. For ten years of his life, Dario only wanted hens like that. Well, you've proven yourself worthy. You can keep the chicken of justice if you want. Seriously? Awesome! Criminals, look out now. <laughs> <laughs> you've got talent, James. This one room, the bedroom, is totally secure. It's a slum, but... I gotta be able to close my eyes sometimes. It's possible to break in there with enough effort, but I'd have time to be awake and ready. And shoot the shelf above the burglar? I'd have time to reload and finish the piece of shit. In the middle of the room was a bunch of files with names. Can't you respect anyone else's privacy? I said none of the siblings knew. If something went wrong, I prepared myself for it. But what's one have to do with the other? I sorted things out for them and left a will that made it clear I believed Taylor and I would be in heaven. You really have to ask that? Of course not! Looks like you covered all the bases. Nice work. Thanks. I try. I hope this isn't a tough question. Sarah... How are Max, Dario, and Peter now? I wasn't talking... I saw the name on the cabinets. Did they... But don't worry, they're all alive. And doing pretty well. They rented a legal apartment, floor 40. They have better air than here. Bodies wear out slower. So how did a slum girl get this job? Maybe you got yours. I had to work for it. For determination. Must not have been easy for you. Fortunate combo. I had insomnia and hated wasting my time. I guess that's how I managed to pass all the exams. Did our department come for Taylor? Yes. So why. Did I join you? Maybe I wanted to take control? Of some sort. I decided I was never going to be powerless like that again. I'm just a liaison, but I already know when and where they move. Was. Which one of us came for Taylor? It was hard to resist the temptation to check it out. I get some revenge? He was so ordinary. A regular agent. But to really get justice, I'd have to get revenge on this whole sick fucking system. We gotta play by the rules. We don't make them. Tell me about it. Don't kill the messenger. What are we drinking to? Well, you're the expert. Sit down and make a toast. 